Hey, Johnny here. We're here for episode two of my player interaction videos. Uh, in this episode, Dragon, Gopher, and myself were running around doing some uh, bounty missions, and I was all chatty chatty, and I bumped into two individuals on board Alistair. One, uh, who I dubbed Andy, because it was easy to say his in game name, and Tortillas, which I shortened to Tort throughout the video as well. <laughs> it was really nice. It was a wonderful time. Uh, we had a, a lot of fun. We brought in one of my new friends, or my old friends from Daisy, into the game, Blacklight. He's been jumping in a little bit, and uh, some hilarious moments with newbies happened. Hope you enjoy. Leave any comments, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Cheers. I can pay you a little extra on the side for some bonuses and stuff. Yeah, for sure, man. I'm using uh, proxy comms right now, so you're hearing just local around me. Hey, buddy, what's going on? Hello. And there you go. What's your name, there, bud? I'm Johnny. Who is this dude right here? What the hell are you decked out in? Tortillas! Hey, well, we're doing some bounties if you want to join up with us. Yeah, we sure, why not? You guys got a multi-crew ship, or...? Uh, we we're using the Hurricane if you want to take over uh, turret gunning with, uh... Uh, Gopher. But if you have a multi-crew, uh, we can we can spread out. We haven't really uh, figured that out here. Hi. This is our, our new friend here, Andy. And Daryl? And Daryl? You're Andy now. Alright, deal. Deal. Andy and Tortilla. Tortillas. All right, so what? Right what do you guys got? We got uh, Bogey outside from what uh, Dragon's in. Dragon's in the Hornet right now. I was running turrets in the Hurricane with Gopher. No, that guy's uh, I've got a black. Oh, you got a Cutlass Black? Okay. What do you got there, Tort? I got a uh, carrot. Oh, really? Dudes, dudes, dudes! Can we? Do you guys want to do turret gunning on a carrot? How many crits does it have? Uh, I'm like four. Four? Okay, so uh, go. Tortillas, my man! Tortillas gonna pilot, so we have our the captain, and then we have myself, we have Dragon, and we have Gopher. Oh, boys! This is what I love about this game, the actual interactions. This is why I use the mic and talk on open channels. See, Andy? Andy, did you think your day was gonna be like this, Andy? No, you didn't. You're like, I'm going to go out my own, same old ship, doing my same old thing. And then all of a sudden, boom. Yeah, it stays on the habitation deck. Hab deck. I have been on a character before, but not a lot. Alright, I am going to hop in my turret and get familiar with it. Oh, hot diggity. Start with this. <laughs> Andy, there is in the the key mappings. If you go into the VoIP key mapping sections, when you go into like advanced, there is a, a proxy com that you you can map. This is the button that seems to work really reliably, but it only works when we're around each other. It's a VoIP push to talk proxy only. Findings advanced. Go down to the very bottom comms. It's not mapped by default. I have it mapped to my uh, uh, my mouse button. So I can just press a button and talk. This is the only one that I've ever works really reliably. The channel ones are very situational. Oh, oh you're a chick. You're a chick under there. <laughs> you're a chick. I didn't know we had a chick on board. Hey, baby, how you doing? <laughs> do some work on this and do some real testing. Sometimes the, the custom channels, they, they work across systems. Sometimes they don't work. Some people get on. This is the only one that i found that actually works consistently. we got to talk to each other around each other. Uh, it works. It works consistently. That's the only thing. It, it, I wouldn't say it's better, but I I know the parameters of it at least. And Proxycom is you just. Going a crusader. So Tortilla, tell us a little bit about yourself. What's expecting you, Karen? I am mainly a hauler. So I uh, I take this big ass ship and I uh, 
pick things up and put them down in another location. How's the pirate activity been for you lately? Like player, player driven. I don't run into them. Well, I mean, I know where they are, so I just don't go there. So I'm safe most of the time. Nice. Have you actually had any encounters, though, with players? Uh, like one, like a month ago. Yeah? But, I mean, for the most part, I can easily get away. Just max speed drive away. Yeah, so if I really it... had an issue. Uh, my main issue was, was 30Ks up until recently. Oh, fuck yeah, man. It's been a lot better recently. Yeah, now I can actually make money. It's nice. Before, I was, I was losing 100K every hour or so. So, yeah, I'm, pr I'm pretty poor now, but I used to be rich. <laughs> I, can I can hear Tortilla now. Nice, where are you? Yeah, yeah, can't be. Where am I what? Oh, sorry, uh, it was, uh, uh, Dragon can hear us, but he can, he's not transmitting, he's not sure why. Uh, okay. Like I said, the point. Yeah, clear. Yeah, okay, cool. So the range is far enough that you can hear up here. It seems to be pretty decent, like it's a decent bubble. Hey, if we're... your pink, uh, flare? Uh, it's Johnny. Bit, Go for it, big one. So I was at a uh, Grim Hex like kind of like 20 minutes ago, and there were like I don't know, like 15 people there. Oh shit! Then let's get our asses over there. Like not yet. Let's get let's do this practice run and see how we actually fight. Uh, well, a Caracol's up. I've never seen it in combat. Against regular guns, it's gonna be tough. If they start torpedoing. There's still a chance you can flare them. It's tough though. And torpedoes hurt. Yeah, okay. So We're torpedoes are the capture killer, which is pretty standard for Chris. Yeah. Although the. Uh, now that the distortion weapons are working, if they, you know, grouped up, they can start taking down the shields of the captain. Swarm of fighters should be taken on. Like if, if the fighters don't so have... you're stuck in that not, sense, you can... I don't think I'm outside of the ship, though. Uh, just suicide, then. You'll, you've bound up the, the med bed, you'll be safe. Okay. Oh, God! Oh. You, you, you're... Oh, no, you're in, like, the co-pilot seat! You're gonna... Uh, press, it again, press it again! Press it again! Press it again! Yeah. Hold it down no, again. Didn't. Hold it down again! Hold it down! You've turned on the self-destruct! Oh, well, I found the ship. Turn off, turn off the self-destruct! <laughs> turn it off! Well, We're all gonna die! Stop yelling! You told me to turn it off after I turned it off, so I turned it back on. I don't know if it's turned off or not, but it keeps making the same noise. I'm just laughing at it. I'm sorry, Black Knight. Oh, fuck it, it's still making the noise. So I should hold back, backspace? Yes. Until it stops. Until it stops. <laughs> I like how Gover's just like, I'm out. Yeah, I like oh, and I just fell out of the goddamn ship too, trying to get out of my turret. Very high self-preservation instinct. <laughs> oh, boy. That's hilarious. Okay, let's ditch this party. Oh, oh, oh. The, the sad thing is, is that Andy's just gonna die. <laughs> yeah. Stop the beeping. All I'm seeing is the oh, did? going round and round and round. Yeah. I think it's because I'm like. Fly oh no, Tortilla's fine. Am I dying out here or something? I don't know. No. But it's definitely not me flying. Oh! And it just blew up. And it killed me, I was too close. <laughs> I was upstairs in the, the stand-up uh, so Yeah, like the admiral the seat or whatever. The, uh, wreck of the no. Thing. No, we're all dead. I was too close. I didn't. I fell out of my turret again. So I'm the sole survivor. You are the sole survivor. You ejected again. Yay! Brave You're Sir Robin. Good. Sir Robin. You're very good at ejecting.